Thank you. Thank you very, very much. Thank Always you for... a pleasure to see Always you. Always nice Conan. to have you. I bow to you. I treat you with more respect than Brokaw. Uh... <laughs> no, no, I love the man. He's been good to us. Uh, I want to say, first of all, it's got to be... You, you've had this amazing success in the last year with American Pie. Yeah. That film went through the roof. Oh. Big time. That's a showbiz expression. It means it did well. Yeah, it went, th <laughs> went through the bake shop window. That's right. Yeah. I've never heard that expression. That oh, you just well. made that up. Uh, but it was extraordinarily successful. How are you? Best pie screwing movie I've ever seen. See? <laughs> <laughs> now go back to the bake shop window <laughs> thing. Did uh, now? But how how have you dealt with that success? Has it you know been well, odd for you? I I I mean it's been great. I mean the, you know the success of that movie's been absolutely wonderful. The sad thing is it's a, it's a, you know it's it's a movie. You know they're they're doing a sequel coming up soon, but they can they can you know no matter how many sequels they do and no matter how old my children become, it's a movie I will never be able to see with my children. It's just one of those movies you don't see with your children. Yeah, it's got a little the off movie. Well, off I mean, you got a, you know, we got a little, uh, you know, a little. Uh, the, the, there's a kind of a masturbation thing. There's a, you know, humping a pie thing. There's, a, there's a, bit, you know, a bit of oral sex. There's somebody <laughs> drinking a beer with something. And I'm saying, you know what? You, you like can't sit down beside your children and kind of elbow them, going, <laughs> "Hey, what do you think of that one, huh?" <laughs> Hey, sweetheart, look at this. What do you think? <laughs> it's you your, old, it? your old man in there. You see so, what he did to that pie, huh? Yeah, my, my, son was, my son was supposed to come to the premiere. I don't know if I told this, but my son was supposed to come to the premiere last year when it opened. He was 16 at the time. And, uh, and he had talked to a friend of his before the, uh, the opening who had seen a sneak preview of it, and, uh, and, the, and, and the friend said, boy, it's really funny. The, you know, it's a, it's a very funny movie. And, and my son said, yeah, I'm going to be seeing it tomorrow night with my dad. And the guy goes, ooh, big mistake. <laughs> <laughs> big mistake. Don't right. see it with your father. And then my son had to come up and say, well, Dad, you know, maybe I, maybe I won't go to the opening, and, uh, you know, I'll see it with my friends. And I'm right. really glad that he made that decision because, <laughs> you know, not having seen the film, right. I was glad that you know my son and daughter weren't there. <laughs> well, best. This is a different movie. This best in show. It's not. It's it's a different film you're doing now. Yeah. Uh, you have a very different look in this movie. Uh, you look. You don't look much like you do right now. No. Well, I had a. I, I had a. I wanted a uh, a look that would um, knock about forty points off my IQ. Right. So I had a little dental thing done. Okay. Um, and uh, and there's the there's the look right there. Let's get it tight we're on We're not that. talking we're not talking Barnum and Bailey here, but it's just enough to kind of uh, accentuate the facial features. And what it does do is, it kind of uh, it kind of dumbs you down about uh, 40, 50, 60 percent. <laughs> And the thing is that uh, while I was on the set and had these teeth in, it was very, uh, very difficult to have uh, people take you seriously when you're talking about just about anything because they, uh, right. uh, for some reason, they would chuckle, they would giggle, they would laugh. I couldn't quite understand why, and then I realized, hey, I still have my teeth in. <laughs> Those are nice. I like, yes. they come out and go down. Yes, they do. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. You do look like a moron now. Uh... Thank you. Thank you very much. You had to train for this film. This film is about dog. Should I finish the interview with the teeth in? Because yeah, I... I think so. Let's keep right. the teeth in for that. All right, very good. You, uh, you had to train because you play a, uh, you play a, tell well, us. Well, what, what we have, this film is about, um, this film is about uh, dogs. I'm losing my concentration a I'm little sorry, bit, I'll I have to admit. Out. You should take those out. This film is about uh, dogs and the world of dog shows. Right. And uh, this is, uh, again, like uh, our last film, Waiting for Guffman, a, a uh, completely kind Which of is improvised... Which a hilarious movie. Thank you. Uh, completely kind of improvised uh, uh, a movie, which is kind of fun, but it's about the world of dog shows. So we did have to, as a cast, we play the owners and the handlers mm -hmm. that enter our dogs into these shows. So we did have to, uh, we did have to uh, train and... Um, and what do, you, what do they have to know? What special skills do you need to know if you, if you work as a, as a dog show uh, 
you know, trainer or judge? What do you well, have to know? Well, what you, what you have to do is be able to show your, uh, present your dog so it shows well. We, we had to, you know, a larger dog, you have to walk your dog into the arena. You have to know how fast to walk so that the in other words, if you're walking a large dog, you would walk slower because the dog has longer legs. Mm -hmm. If you're walking a smaller dog, you have to walk quicker so that the dog walks quicker and, and his gait is, is showing itself off. More attractive, uh, yes. right. The, mo the more difficult thing for me was uh, what they call stacking the dog because, uh, uh, which is, you know, the dog I had was a smaller dog, was like a, a, a terrier. Um, we have a little and uh, yeah, you were here. very you were kind enough to. Uh, uh, <laughs> so this is like the How does size. It work? Yeah. This is the size of the dog that uh, that we had to 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 to, uh, to kind of work with. Right. And stacking the dog means that uh, when the judge is examining uh, your dog in the event itself, you have to uh, lift the dog from the floor so that the dog the judge doesn't get down on his hands and knees. Right and have to examine the dog on the floor. So you, you have to lift the dog onto a table so the judge can examine him more easily, but you have to lift the dog up and place him so that he's already set in his best showing position. So the tough thing was, you know, uh, I don't know if I can demonstrate sure. here, but the, uh, the left hand goes under the neck okay. uh, on the dog like, uh, like so, and uh, the right hand goes around the You, you split your fingers. Uh, I don't know what you call them on television. Is that a, a correct thing? Fingers is fine, yeah. Oh, fingers. <laughs> so, uh, so the right hand here goes right around the <laughs> And this is the... Uh, uh, and testicles. That, no, I'm not making testicles, this. Testicles, maybe. Making this. Oh, testicles. That's right. I'm sorry. <laughs> so you... you, you, you uh, so what you do is you, you, you lift these... the dog so he stays straight. Right. And you put him down right. and he is in the perfect uh, position and it's it's not an easy thing and I thought this is the perfect position oh I guess if well, I'm the judge no, if you're the judge okay this, right this, this right. sets the dog straight so right. his head is his head is right because your hands under here nice and his back legs are spread like so because your 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 Stop fingers doing that are that's <laughs> well if arousing you're... me and I want it to stop well, now, you know, uh, you know we're, just, or, or, we're pretty much out of time. Yeah. Is there anything? Oh. So that's pretty well, much it? Yeah, well, I wanted to, uh, do we have time? Because I, I wanted to, it's a tricky kind of thing, and I didn't know whether. Do you want me to give it a try? I, I would love for you to just, uh, okay. you know, because it's kind I'll of a tricky it. thing. Okay. No, I'm going to use this just to k k keep things going here. Okay. I'm going to use this to, in case You'll you need help. You'll use that one. What do you want me to use? Well, I want you to use uh, another dog that we're bringing in here. <laughs> Come around. Can, you want to come around? Hi, What's sweetie. This? Hi. Hi, sweetie. Okay. Look at this little dog. And what would I, I do? Okay, well, the dog is up like this. First of Can all... Can I just... <laughs> yeah, hi, honey. Look. Hmm, it's beautiful. All right. <laughs> I'm not touching this dog. <laughs> I don't know this dog. We're going to take a break, but uh, best of luck with the film. That was, it was a sweet ending when you oh, kissed the dog, look. and now I'll kiss you. Eugene Levy, everybody, we'll take a break. <laughs>